Hey everybody, it's Maggie Mulhern from Modern Salon TV. I'm here with Colin Green Tanner at Ardell. We're at Premiere 2013, and you guys are doing something pretty exciting, right? I mean, we you're... are. We're just introducing our new color effects lashes. I've got them in three different styles and three different colors: our wine, plum, and <laughs> blue. And so okay. what we're trying to do is introduce our new colored lashes to everyone and help them pick out the new lashes. So when for, a, for a, a professional makeup artist, how does he or she determine what color to use on a client? What you do is work with the client on what color their eyes are and what style is going to best fit their eye. So like if I were working on your eyes with the brown, I would end up going with a blue. I want to accent the eye, make it pop a little bit more, and make them a little bit more dramatic without being over the top. We want to give them something that they can wear every day. Okay, so for the client with um, blue eyes, what would you recommend? I would generally go with either the wine or the plum. These are going to help accent them, bring the color out without being too much, but giving them a little bit alteration or a little bit, you know, umph to their look. Okay, what does that leave? Green eyes. Green eyes. You'd also go with either the plum or the wine because it's going to bring them out a little bit more. Okay, anything that we didn't cover. What about shape? How do you determine what shape to use on a client? What shape I would go with is a lot with the client's personality, which would be what kind of, you know, how dramatic are they going to be? Do I want to use a demi-lash, which is going to be short on the inside, long on the outside? Or do I want something like a 110 that's going to be a lot more natural for the look and something to just make them look a little bit, you know, more awake for the day? Okay, so what is a tip in general? Uh, on eyelash application for the professional makeup artist. You don't need much adhesive. The biggest thing I see people do is too much adhesive. Let's just get a nice thin line on there. We don't want it to be too heavy and we don't want it to take forever to dry. Okay, Colin, I'm not letting you go till we talk about this fingernail. What's going on there? Show it. I did the Nail Tech Expo yesterday for the meet and greet. And so I was working with a couple different nail techs on styles and shapes. And so I wanted to see them put on. The only way to really know how a product works is to use it yourself. So when you go uh, going to put on some eyelashes on somebody and you go with that, do people go running? I've had a few people flinch a little bit, but you learn to keep them back and you can actually use them. Even with long nails on, you can put eyelashes on. Well, that's pretty cool. You notice that I didn't ask him to put any on me. I mean, you're, you're terrifying. <laughs> I'll get you next time. <laughs> thanks so much, Colin. My pleasure. Okay, thanks.